Hey y'all, it's Amy, <clears throat> and uh, yeah, I got some makeup on my face, um, but I'm going to be doing a somewhat of a Christmas look because I was requested by it. Um, I was requested to do a candy cane look, but I'm not. I'm gonna wait for that a little bit so I can figure out what I want to use, like. Do I even want to use Facebook or Facebook? Do I want to use uh what's it called? Do I want to use face paint or actual eyeshadows? So today I'm just gonna do a normal makeup that you can wear out. Um, right here I got some concealer by this palette. It's green concealer. It's right here. I already prepped my eyeballs with uh elf eye primer and i also put the nyx uh milk on my eyes like i always do um so we are going to get started on the eyes and And I'm just going to use a very fluffy brush. And I never use this. I just got this in family mail. And I do want to apologize to the guy that sent me this. I said it was a joke that he sent me this because he was, he made a video about it. And I just wanted to apologize and say I do appreciate you sending me, taking out the time and send me this stuff. Um. I never meant to be rude about it, but I knew it was a joke, and, uh, oh man, I put my finger in it, really, anyway, um, maybe I should use a fluffier brush, maybe that one will be good, um, but I'm going to use the shade right here. And just go along my edge of my eye. I'm going for somewhat of a, let me twist a little. I'm going for somewhat of a no makeup look. Um, we'll see how it goes. Um, trying to fix the lighting. I didn't blow the product. I blow. I was blowing my what was on my hand off. Just to let y'all know that. So I'm gonna go ahead and dip into a darker shade. It just blended. And I do want to come on here and apologize to everybody for in the comments below. They were getting bullied and I do not condone that. I haven't even been reading the comments lately. I mean, I replied to some, the, I think it was last night, but other than that... I haven't been doing anything on the comments because I'm just getting tired of all the bullying and it's just getting pretty overwhelming and I don't want that. 
So that's the eyes I'm going for. I'm going to get a little bit of darker. Just a little, just like a hair. And just darken up that. I'm not going for over the top dramatic eyes. Um, is that on my nose? We like, I don't know, it just, to me it looks like there's something right there. Um, so now I'm going to be using my eyeshadow from Push Cosmetics. Uh, I did a review on it, Push Mac. Uh, I did a review on this, if you want to go check that out. It's a beautiful copper color. And I'm just going to pat it. With this sponge applicator. This is the color I wore to my brother's wedding. Why is this lighting making me look like I got a black nose? I really like this color. Uh, Okay, next I'm going to do my foundation, and today I'm going to be using the Clinique and Stay Matte Alabaster. Um, they gave me a free sample at Dillard's, um, so I'm just going to be using that today, and just poking it. Um, my Beauty Blender is wet. Uh, I know somebody asked me that, and I'm like, yeah, it is, but I didn't reply. Uh, well, I don't think I did anyway. I might have. So if you ever wonder if my beauty blender is wet when I do my makeup, yeah, it usually is. I just do it off screen just to save some time and effort uh, in the video. And I know y'all like seeing me do this part, so I'm not going to stop the video today. Somebody asked me to not stop it, just keep going. I just want to be able to wipe it and go. And this was actually colored and matched to me. And it's, oh, and it kind of looks pale. It might be just the lighting. I am going to rub right here, though.
Now I'm gonna do my eyebrows and I'm gonna use the the lightest color possible because this is a natural look. Um, no editing type of deal. One take, wonder. Get your torture devices. Y'all got them? I'm going to be using the CoverGirl Flame Out Mascara. Now I'm going to do my eyeliner and today I'm going to try to use this little cat eye thingy. Let's see if, I don't know if you can tell. But, um, nah, I don't think I'm going to use it. Just to give a little bit. Um, I don't have any brown, but if I did, I'd probably use it. Just to. Keep the natural look about me. Um, now I'm going to be using the CoverGirl. Wait, is this? It might be Ella Kelly. I don't say anymore. It's black eyeliner. Again, you can use brown. I just don't keep brown. Just a subtle look, nothing special. I did kind of mess that up a little. Now I'm going to start my contouring and I'm going to be using this concealer on my blemishes and right here. And right here, and right here, and a little right here. So I'm going to get another damp beauty blender and just Pass that in. And that's a tattoo, so we got a snake bite or vampire bites. So 
nobody's ever seen anything on my neck. Um, that's what it is. So now I'm going to start my contouring. <clears throat> and I've got this palette and I'm using this color wait yeah this color right here Okay. Now I'm going to set everything with this. It's a Colormates pressed powder and it's in rose beige. I'm just going to use a fluffy brush instead of my witch's broom. Okay. Well, maybe I try my witch's broom out with this powder. Yeah, that's a lot it works a lot better. So I'm going to use this e.l.f. concealer stick and try to conceal a little bit more. Of course, my face looks like this all the time. Alright, and for blush, I'm going to be using this. I'm just going to use this Hello Kitty fluffy brush. Just a natural, everyday look that you can do. You don't really want to do uh, nothing really big. I mean, like, if you're just having family over and you don't want to spend a full glam makeup. Uh, so the next I'm going to be doing is this L'Oreal Paris Rimmel London. What am I talking about? Matte Show Off Lipstick in Apollo. It's this nice nitty color. And It is, it says lip velvet. 
and it does go on velvety and it's got an applicator with a hole in the middle. I guess I could have should have concealed that a little bit more. But yeah, this is my Christmas look. Um I hope y'all enjoyed it and I think it came out pretty good. But I don't know. Thank y'all so much for watching. Have a nice day. I'll talk to you later. Bye, YouTube. Subscribe. Mm -hmm.